would you describe your coaching style? <laughs> oh gosh, um, I. How do other people um, define my coaching style? I think crazy, ridiculous, in, uh, intense. I like to win, and and I'll do legally whatever it takes to be successful and to try to score one more point than the other team. So make no mistake, at the base of who I am, I love to compete, but I also love the relationships that I'm so thankful for with my players. The relationships to me are everything. Coach Kylie's helped me grow as a person really similarly to the way he's helped me grow as a basketball player. He's always pushing me off the court to be the best person I can be. That's something he, we really value in the Olympia program is not just being great basketball players, but green, being great people. And he's helped teach me many, many lessons off the court of how to just be a good person and the things that are important in life other than basketball. I expect our best game, and I want no doubt who the best program is in Thurston County. Let's go! From the tip tonight, all night long, let's go to work. All night together. Bears, one, two, three. Bears! Bears. Good luck. Let's own our county right now. Let's go. Right now, from the start, bench be loud. Bears, one, two, three. Let's go to work. Mason, you start on 21. Again, horns just switch everything. Trust your switches tonight. Let's go to work, let's go. Alfredo, I wouldn't shoot that and I'll tell you why. To go from the bench to there, I'd probably take a pull up and shoot a 10 footer or something. That's just from a, just yeah. when I'm off a bench. And then once you feel it, then you always shoot it. Why are we fouling under their basket? Don't do that. Let's run stack against that. X the next time if we have something to run. Hey, can we pull it, can we turn it up right now? Come on, pressure a little bit. Why are you backing up? Pressure. Good, good, good. Dude, dude, to get around. Go, pick up. Ball's going up, it's going up. Oh yeah, yeah, easy, easy. Jeff. Jeff, every, every one of those has been a charge so far today. What was different about that one? Uh, we were still jumping, John. We were still jumping. No. The no. It was a block. It was a block. Watch every college game. There's no way he'd call that. That's what the game's at. It's up there. I think we can create a lot of fun in this second half. You want to have some fun? Let's go look. Paris, one, two, three. Paris. Great job. You have to extend up. Just jump as high as you can. And then hands up on the real on the basket. Good job. Get in there in the second one. Right, half court man. If you close out early with a high hand, he won't even shoot it. Assume that, then come down. Okay? And make something happen offensively. Just get unlocked. Hey, good job, Tennis, here for the Bears. Good job. Um, and before I forget, because I might uh, Cree, that was the uh, best shot I've ever seen somebody hit. Let's hear it for Cree's birthday. Let's go. Here we go. One, two, three. Dominate the weight. We control our fate. Every practice, every rep, one more step. Every on three, 
Family, one, two, three. Family. Family. Daniel Duncan impacts us in a lot of ways. You know, he is a young man that really wants to be part of something bigger than himself and truly is a um, icon at this school. When people see Daniel, you know, they just want to be a part of, of his life and he wants to engage with them. And, and you, see, you see it throughout the season, the different ways he, he uh, connects with individual players, with the, the student section for sure, and, and our team. He's a special young man. Yeah, I'm mic'd up. You are? Nice. Yep. Oh, okay. Yep. These guys don't even look as, they don't, they don't look the part. Let's go, Creep. You're an animal. Attack. Let's go, Dre. Gotta get some good shots up. Gotta get some good shots up. Here we go, Ron. Woo-hoo. Take care of business, boys. Family, go to work. Pressure him, White. Contain him. Contain him. Take him out of his rhythm. Take him out of his rhythm. Come on, come on. Come on, come on. Send it up. Nice, nice. Had him with Josh. Let him do it again. Brick City, Brick City. Hands up, hands up, hands up. Get it up. Let it fly. Yeah! Yeah! Yes! Yes! All right, let's go. Pick it up. Pick it up. Pick it up. High intensity, championship mentality. High intensity. Hey! They got nothing against us. They got nothing. Hey, let's get loud. Let's get loud. Let's go. Hey, let's go to work. Gonna work. High intensity. High intensity. Let's go. Run them over. Run them over. Run them over. over. Let's go. Let's go. Oh yeah. Yeah. <laughs> let's go. I hope that my seniors will say that they had just the time of their lives. That every day was, was hard and maybe predictable or unpredictable, but that they would rather not do anything else than to be together with their brothers and play this game that we love, a game that takes such teamwork and such unselfishness and sacrifice. All these words and concepts that literally should help them succeed throughout their lifetimes if they embrace all of that. So I hope that they remember Chick Rocky. I hope they remember coming out of that, that, that door from the locker room and, and hear the fans and see this majestic auditorium and, and enjoy every minute on the court and during the games. But ultimately, I hope they want to come back and, and remember and connect and cherish and relish in the history of what their experience was all about as an Olympia basketball player. And if that happens, it was a success. Ladies and gentlemen, it is senior night here. We are going to recognize the Bears basketball players. Our first senior 
is Noah Boyd. Our next senior is Sam Grant. Jack Olson. Zach Swanson. Jackson Grant. Josh Kylie. Last but not least, senior Alfredo Ramirez Cortez. thankful we have a senior night. I'm so thankful. Who knew months ago if we were going to have a senior night? We have a senior night to celebrate people that have done so much for this program. Well, let's add another little notch to that tonight. Let's add another little piece of the legacy of what happens when someone comes into our gym. Because when they come into our gym, they should expect an absolute war. They should expect a fight that they don't want any part of. And, and that has to be an expectation of Chick Rocky Gymnasium. And you bring that smartly, you bring that together. Senior night 2021, it should be chew them up and spit them out. Let's go! Big vibes. Look, I'm about my plan. And forward, he's a senior. Number 24, Sam Grant! section is 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 monumental it's such a big part of of our program I we do believe they're family they're part of who we are they're an extension of what we're doing on the court and their energy at times their ability to impact the play of, of individual players on the other side can be kind of fun for us <laughs> uh, but they're a they're a big part of who we are and the energy and the positivity mostly. Uh, we really feed off of that. Play hard, play strong, and play as a team, and we can beat anyone we want to beat. Love this team. Best team in the state. Keep going, boys. I hope this state tournament so we can show everyone what we're about. Go Oli! Let's f***ing kill these kids. I hate to cuss, but I'm just so passionate about this team. These boys, let's go! It's going to be a great game tonight. We got Noah Boyd on the court. My second favorite memory of the year might really be when Noah got into that game. And he did so much for our program, you know, people around the Olympia basketball team and programs saw the contributions of Noah day after day, the selfless setting up the clock and, and sweeping the floor and making sure that the uniforms were right and then engaging and scouting and he did everything. So Noah gets to the free throw line late. 
and missed that first shot. And I challenged him. I said, Noah, make this thing. And he looked at me and uh, bounced it a couple times. And Hit that shot, and it's a memory none of us will, will forget. I think the atmos atmosphere at practice is intentional. I feel like I want it to be high paced, I want it to be, you know, just fast action a lot of decision making so that when you get to a game situation, you've already done, it's easier. And, and not that it's easier because of the fans and the situation, but, but that it's already second nature to be in a situation where you have to problem solve and do it quickly. And with noise, we have the uh, you know, music playing a lot. And that's just to get guys to have to focus and ensure that no matter what happens in a game situation, that they've already been preconditioned to handle that situation and be ready to succeed. But then also we take time to make sure everybody's doing all right, to check in, how's your day going, either at the start of practice or at the end of practice. So it's also an important time to make sure that as we journey together, that we don't forget to enjoy the, the, uh, the, the journey as a, as a unit. So, so the Hollywood ending for us is, is cutting down the nets next Thursday, right? The Hollywood, it's not Hollywood, Hollywood. Uh, it's not what we have dreamt about yet, but, but it's a nice ending to cut those net, the nets down and, and put up a little, a little deal and, and, and that'd be great. You know, that, that's, that's what I'm expecting. Absolutely expecting, without a doubt. But I'm okay if it's not the Hollywood ending. Uh, my life's had some Hollywood endings and it's had some Hollywood flops. And, and so I'm okay either way. And, and, and you're going to be okay either way. Uh, don't lose sight of the pursuit. All right? This is the pursuit of greatness. This is the pursuit of excellence. This is the pursuit of being the best we can be day after day, connected to each other in a way that's unconditional and is, is unable to be broken. And, and if that means we're cutting nets down next Thursday, absolutely can't wait. There'll be a lot more smiles and there'll be tears. Uh, but that's up to us. That we, we can control all of that possession by possession. But it won't define us. It won't define a legacy. Like like
stop us. They really can't stop us. But we, we did plenty of times on ourselves. They're not helping on Jackson. That's our game. We don't need Hollywood. We got something better than that. But, cut down some nets. I love nets. Every practice, every rep. We need a great practice today. You've been great practice. Hard working fellas, let's add another step today. We've got four left. Let's make this one count. Fair play. Good evening, ladies and gentlemen, and welcome to Emerald Ridge High School. And that takes everybody bringing his gifts and everybody bringing his will and everybody bringing his, his confidence and his, his, uh, his role. Whatever that is that night. Where this thing means so much to you that you just, you just will do whatever it takes. And you guys are looking around each other. Look around each other real quick. Yeah, it's hokey. Look around each other real quick. Look at each other's eyes, man. You guys, you guys have shared a lot of meals. You guys have shared beds. You guys have shared houses. You guys have shared a lot. Isn't it worth it for them? Because right now we're in a really important time. I always say, it's not what happens. It's how we react. How are we going to react to this tonight? Yeah, I have, high, I have high hopes for the next week. So a week from tonight, we're done. A week from tonight. I, I've been really intentional because it makes me sad. I love you guys so much. It makes me sad to think about next week. And I don't want to put that pressure on you. So I haven't been talking about next week. We've had so much great, we have so much fun. We've had such great time together. We've had so many great times. So many great years of development. So much greatness. So much great things ahead. I'm going to be sad because it's over. So I haven't been talking about I didn't want to put that pressure on. But the reality is, in a week, we're done. A week from today. I believe in you. I love this team. I believe we can be one of the best teams that's ever put on that jersey. But you gotta walk the dog. You gotta earn it. And we don't have a lot of time. 24 hours times seven. I wouldn't waste a minute. Darn you. I wouldn't waste a minute. Because I know you're going to miss it. And I'm going to miss you. Let's do the big one. One, two, three. Dominate quick. We control our fate. And we practice every rep. One more step. Three, one, two, three. Yeah, we control our fate. Nothing more true has ever been said 
understand that. My favorite game was probably the Sumner game. It's a battle of just making the right plays repeatedly. It's staying understanding of where we're at, what we're doing, what they want to do, what we want to do. We do more of what we want to do, less of what they want to do, and uh, good things are going to happen today and tonight. Let's start with them. Number two, uh, Spencer Midrange. I forgot to say. talking about leaving no doubt all year. Who's the dominant team? Who plays best together? Who cares more about each other? Leave no doubt tonight. How you leave no doubt tonight is from the time you get out there, you do everything you've been doing. You turn the corner. You're humble. You turn the corner. You're hungry. You've turned the corner. There's nobody playing like we're playing in the state of Washington right now. Nobody. I'll pick you. I'll pick you. I'll pick you every freaking time. Go get him. Oh, yeah. <laughs> And now hit that thing and go. When they let us out there, go out and get ready to play. Fight, compete, and let's give them everything we got. Leave no doubt. Bears, one, two, three. Bears! Hello, and welcome to a place we like to call the Valley. For tonight's semifinal matchup between the visiting Bears, Olympia High School, and your Sumner Spartan. The champ Spencer from the Olympia fan section.
perimeter basketball. proud of you guys. I, we were built and we did all this work for a year for that opportunity. Fredo's right here for that opportunity. And you guys just stayed together. You stayed. Tie game, you made it the play of the game, man. You made the steal and the finish and just everybody just dug in. You just dug in. You didn't leave each other. What a life lesson, man. You didn't leave each other. You just stayed together. And we're playing for the championship. <laughs> Let's go beat the Vikings, win this thing. Great oh, job. Yeah.
featuring the Bears of Olympia and the Curtis Vikings.
my new all-time leading scorer at Olympia High School, Jackson Grant. This guy right here has earned a two thousand dollar scholarship from Brown. You say, say, cause I can really use a friend. Stay, please stay, cause my heart really needs a man. Somewhere, somehow, I guess I lost it all. Stay, stay here with me. It's a lot more fun to, uh, to decompress and share after a win. I'm so proud of you guys. You, you literally uh, played your best basketball today. And it's different now. <laughs> today changes a lot. Um, but you have uh, left a legacy. So grateful to be part of this team and the journey we've had this year. You know, it's just awesome to see how close of a group you guys are. And just like 1 through 12, 1 through 13, and the coaching staff. You know, it's something you guys, you guys. We'll lean on each other for the rest of your life. First, just to lighten it up a little bit, look at Coach Trey over there. How? <laughs> <laughs> Can we do that on? Yeah, I that. Like that pose is like a, <laughs> <laughs> like a bottle. Right yeah. there. So we're sure. I'm very thankful for each and every one of you. Um, just because you guys all pushed me to be not only a better basketball player, but a better person. Yeah, congratulations. You guys played uh, like one of the greatest teams to ever play at Olympia High School. And uh, we said that was going to be a goal this year, and you attain that in no uncertain terms. So, uh, I love you. 2021, let's hear it for the SPSL champ. Let's go!
try and get grip, but it don't make sense. Cause you can lose life on this fast route. Yeah, turn thoughts to a cash cow. I might flip that to the glass house. I don't need the accolades. I'm in love with the chase. I just wanna eat, save a spot. Like the table. I need a pen. Can I get one other than red? Thank you. I don't like that color. I hate that color. Go potty? Go, 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 go a little further. You done tinkling? Will you wash your hands, please? It's disgusting. Ten seconds. Kidding, get over here. You don't have little bears this year? which is kind of sad, um, but you got each other, and we've had that for 14 months. And so we, some of you have treated each other like little bears and big bears and punches and headlocks and... And all that. You've had a, a lot of... Uh, uh, um, <laughs> you've had... Why are you so pissed? Yeah, yeah, you are. You're absolutely pissed. But, but let, me, let me finish with this. In all seriousness, let me finish with this. Yeah, let's go, baby.